Several years ago, while sitting around a campfire, Bill Hennick had a bright idea. After thinking it over, he came up with a way to combine two of his passions, beer and fishing, into art. Photojournalist Mike Radford spent a little time at his studio recently. Take a look. A bunch of buddies were sitting around a campfire drinking a few beers and I'm me being the resident tree hugger I we re recycled all our bottles but we re I realized you know somewhere in this night that I said we just throw all the beer caps away so I started saving them with no real intention of what I was going to do with them and me being an avid fisherman and my wife and I both scuba dive I said all right I'll, I'll make a fish I just thought that the colors, the eyes, everything just reminded me of Steven Tyler of Aerosmith and being an Aerosmith fan. I had to name a fish after Steven Tyler. I guess it was his mouth as much as anything else. And I don't ever name them until after I'm done with them. And then I go, who does this remind me of? But that's Slim Whitman. That's my only... Um, devotee right now into country music. That's Jerry Garcia. And that's um, the hair and the beard got me a little bit. I thought the Corona caps were kind of appropriate. I develop a real um, thought process when I'm going through and thinking about these characters. And when I do finally name them, I've spent a lot of time with them. So yes, I, 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 I find them fun. I, I don't want to go so far to say they're my friends because then everybody think I'm totally lost it. And one of the fringe benefits of this is that, oh man, I'm three caps short. I got to go get a six pack, you know? And, and, and so it's all for the sake of the fish it has nothing to do with the beer. And I just try to constantly be a little bit more creative and be a little bit more, um, add a little bit more what my wife has named whimsy. I try to add a little bit more whimsy to every fish. Somebody will see them on a website and contact me to do one, a special order. People at the TACA show, I still get calls from people that were at the show about one for my father. I wanted to give him a present. And then they'll see him hanging up in, in a house and say, hey, I saw this, um, can you make me one? And a lot of people will send me specific caps to do them on. I said, this one looks like Joe Cocker. Uh, I'm sorry, uh, if, you, if you've ever watched Joe Cocker perform. And those have to, have to paint his mouth and then put his teeth in. So it's a process that you just can't throw it together. But what, what I hope it does is lets people remember things that, that brought them uh, a smile maybe back in their day, and this fish reminds them of that. <laughs>